What is going on guys, iStrategies here bringing you a video on how to install IC Enhancer 3.0 for uh, Grand Theft Auto 4. Uh, it's really easy, all you have to do is pretty much uh, copy and paste sort of installation. So we'll get straight to it. First step you need to download the IC Enhancer mod for your Grand Theft Auto 4 patch. So there will be separate download links in the description. Um, I'm running 1.0.7 so I'm downloading the mod for 1.0.7 um, so basically just click download to your computer and it will start downloading I already have the file so I am not going to download it again um, so once you get it you will have a RAR file that looks like this if you don't have a program to open RAR files uh, there is a link for WinRAR in the description which is a free program obviously um, now inside the RAR file there is two folders. One's called Optimus GPUs which is for Optimus graphics cards. Um, basically just copy and paste them into your Grand Theft Auto 4 directory. However, a large majority of people don't have Optimus graphics cards so I'm not going to show you how to do it. Um, so with this other folder, this is the folder for your Grand Theft Auto 4 patch. All you need to do is extract it onto your desktop just like that. And then once you've done that you can close the RAR uh, file. Now next step is to open your Grand Theft Auto 4 directory. Now by default it is uh, C Drive Program Files by 86, um, Rockstar Games and then this is it here so it'll just be in here. Um, although before you do any uh, modding or anything to your game I highly recommend you make a backup so just copy and paste your Grand Theft Auto, Grand Theft Auto 4 directory um, just like that. So you can see here, mine, I've already made a copy. These, are this is just a clean install with all the default files. Um, so yeah, make sure you do that because I see enhancer. If you uh, don't do it correctly, or something conflicts, the game will crash. So instead of reinstalling the whole game, you can just delete, like use this backup folder. Um, anyway. Uh, moving on with the installation, all you need to do now is open up the extracted folder on your desktop and just select all these files and copy them into your uh, Grand Theft Auto directory. So just paste. Um, now I've already installed the mod so that's why it's saying copy and replace for me but it shouldn't say that for you. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it and once you've done that you then have IC Enhancer installed, so installed. So, um, yeah, it's a really effective mod, really good for um, making the game more visually pleasing, and uh, pretty basic. Uh, doesn't get much easier than that. Anyway, if you do run into any problems or issues, uh, leave a comment below, and I'll make sure to help you out, or someone else can help you out, and. Uh, yeah, so please give the video a like and subscribe to my channel if this helped. Cheers, guys.